oh my god you are back again yes it must be that friday feeling that feeling where you just feel so good oh yes today we're going to feel good because we are firing up the west engine on the spitfire yes we are with the custom exhaust there she is all ready to rock and roll in fact she's already ready already ready ready <laughs> she's already been fired up this is the aftermath so you know she didn't blow up or did she There you go, fired up at last. Now, it was a bit edgy. Um, she did want to come off the stand. I had my son Harrison helping me. Um, it was a bit crazy. Trying to video something so violent. Uh, <laughs> so crazy, uh, you know, it's just, this would normally be done on a stand. Um, but as you've seen, the, the engine couldn't just be taken out and put on a stand. And here goes a very low, low Chinook. Don't know if you can hear that, but it's making the uh, the hangar rumble. So she must be quite low, which is a shame. I could have got some footage, but anyway, whatever. We got some engineage. So <laughs> yeah, I was really happy with that. It was really hard. I mean, because I didn't have the um, control horns or control wires. Sorry for the um, for the uh, throttle. Um, I, I kind of made up, as you saw, I was pulling one. I put it back through the arse here. You can see there, um, and it's all kind of linkaged. Um, up on that um, just because there wasn't a hole there and I didn't have time to mess about put servos in and everything else it was just raw as they come I'm really hot it's really hot in the hangar today it's been really weird weather and it's another week of rain in the UK um, I've missed out on a couple of days so I've been working which I could have flown really annoying I just need you know we just need good weather we had it was about 32 in the UK now anyone that's not in the UK thinking 32 well that's not really hot that's nice. Trouble is with the UK is the humidity. It's like being in the tropical jungle. It, you walk one step and you've lost 10 stone through sweat. Not a pretty sight, I'm telling you. Anyway, so I'm glad you liked that. I mean, we've got some footage as we could. Um, now you're saying, why didn't you get so lots of smoke out the pipes? Well, Alan's fuel, uh, which, you, which you've seen, if not, here's a picture of the fuel that we used. Um, Alan's fuel, he makes it at Western UK um, and it doesn't smoke. You saw a bit of smoke of the, the, the smoking gun shot, the James Bond shot that we saw. Um, both exhausts did that at the end. It was hard to catch because it was quite windy out there as well today. Um, but yeah, it was pretty cool. But it doesn't smoke 
um, like other fuels. Um, she ran well. I didn't want to run her too long because obviously she probably overheat. That's why um, I didn't put um, all the cowling on and everything else. Um, Alan said, you know, don't really sit there and run it because she'll just overheat. Um, which I, I think she did once. It might have been the throttle, I don't know, but it stopped. But I don't know, don't know. Um, I, I think that's a nice fire up of that engine. Um, what she's going to sound like in the air, probably totally different. Um, she sounded really nice. It was really hard to get a low throttle, uh, mainly because of the linkage. It was very sensitive. Um, but as I say, next week we're putting all the electronics in. I'm missing some electronics. Um, as you saw, I've got, uh, I, I dag out, I totally forgot, I've got the SBC, uh, which is the FR Sky SBC, uh, which I guess probably still use. Um, but obviously I need that, uh, the lead for the, um, for the electronics and everything else. I, I just got to do it. I haven't, uh, I didn't, I wasn't prepared today, should we say. Me prepared? <laughs> Come on, you know me too well. <laughs> I'm never prepared, mainly because I'm working my ass off and, and I get little time, unfortunately. Uh, of late uh, and the hang has been about 38 degrees or whatever it is and uh, it's just been too hot to sit in here and do stuff uh, but I hope you enjoyed that anyway I mean you can I, I, you didn't see me you might have saw my random leg shot and me skinny shorts uh, but it's it's I was overjoyed I, I yeah scared oh yes yeah, scared but overjoyed with that with the engine noise and everything else I don't know uh, whether um, it's going to be justice because obviously I've not put them put the uh, spit it out boy I haven't put the movie together so I don't know what the sound's going to be like but hopefully it's going to be good but it sounded good especially when I don't know if we'll get a couple of shots of it but especially when it near enough idling when it's near enough conking off it made it's a special sound but the exhaust worked fine Alan did a great job and I'm sure when she gets in the air um, which I'm determined to do this month to this year I mean, we've got a rest. Well, we've got another week, which is raining. Hopefully, August is going to be a nice weather for the UK. I don't know. Um, a lot of people just go go for it, which is brilliant. Uh, but as you know, you know, I don't like to make excuses, but I can't just go out there and go for it, unfortunately. But nevertheless, I still, still, you know, holding on. You know, I'm not going to give up. You know, I'm just going to keep cracking on. Get all my planes built. I've got to stop buying planes. <laughs> I have no room. V2 hangar. It's been delayed by about 10 years. It's gone crazy. I don't know. Wood didn't come into the country. So I don't know. So I've got to be careful of space. Um, yeah, but anyway, if, if you can fly this weekend, then get out there and fly. And I'm sure I'll watch it on your YouTube channels. If not, stay safe, be safe, and uh, tinker around with your engines. Um, and uh, maybe not so a nitro one. <laughs> in fact, get out there and get a play with your nitro scares the hell out of me why i don't know but it just does but uh yeah so anyway from from the spitfire goodbye and myself thanks for popping by and uh you have good fun now tell on now bye bye